Hello and welcome to this episode. International Women's Day, Pakistan Police Baton Charge Aurat March Participants The yearly Aurat March in Pakistan highlights the worsening condition of the women in the country. Despite progress in some areas, women in Pakistan still face discrimination, violence and limited access to education and economic opportunities. The pandemic has only exacerbated these issues with reports of increased domestic violence and gender-based violence. The Aurat March serves as a platform for women to demand their rights, challenge patriarchal norms and call for systematic change. However, it also faces backlash from conservative groups who view it as a threat to traditions. The worsening condition of women in Pakistan underscores the urgent need for sustained effort to promote gender equality and women's empowerment. A violent crash broke out in Pakistan's Islamabad on the occasion of International Women's Day on Wednesday as women and transgender people from various fields gathered outside the press club for the Aurat March rally where the local police thrashed the attendees with batons and allegedly tried to stop the rally. Interior Minister Rana Sanaullah said on Wednesday that the police personnel involved in the baton charging the participants of Aurat March, a public demonstration held annually in various cities to mark International Women's Day in Islamabad had been suspended. In a tweet, the minister said other persons responsible for misbehavior were also being identified and proper action would also be taken against them. In an earlier tweet, the interior minister had vowed that strict legal actions would be pursued against those responsible for this mistreatment of citizens participating in the march. Sanaullah said he had taken strict notice of the behavior meted out to the participants of the march adding that the Islamabad police chief had been summoned regarding the matter. We will keep you up to date. Thank you and have a nice day.